corner, the challenger, fighting out of Nashville, Tennessee, weighing an even 140 pounds, with a professional record of 16 wins, four defeats, one draw, with six of uh, 14 KOs. Ladies and gentlemen, here is Daryl Fast Fists Fuller. And in the red corner, introducing from Miami, Florida, weighing 140 pounds, his professional record, 19 wins, two defeats, one draw with 16 KOs. Ladies and gentlemen, the Continental America Super Lightweight Champion, Kel Special K, Robin. Round number one here in this 12 round place. Oh, full of tag all of a sudden, and goes down from Miami, Florida. Here is Phil Action Jackson. Jackson. His opponent in the red corner wearing the maroon colored trunks with white trim. He weighs 229 pounds. His professional record, 31 victories, one defeat. He has 21 wins by way of knockout. He is a four-time Golden Glove champion of Tennessee. He hails from Nashville, Tennessee. Here is Keith McKnight. It's always great to see what a fighter does when he comes out on the second round after a first round of basically feeling up you can get away with and what you're going to get hit with. Oh. Knight in the room got hit by Jackson. But Phil Jackson has done some damage early in round two. Oh. And down he goes again. A three knockdown rule is in effect here in Tennessee. The second time down for me. Nice shot and down goes the champion. A right hand is here. And in the corner of Daryl Fuller. Five and six. The champ has the heart. He's up to seven and eight with a Davy Pro. We'll let it continue. And he will. There's a minute to go. Fuller moves into the kill. And down goes Robin again. He won't get it because down a third time. It will be over. He's tired. He's moving back. And Davy Pro stops the fight. It's all over. Kind of an unusual way it happened. It'll be scored as a TKO. At two minutes, 25 seconds of the 11th round, yes. the winner by a TKO and new Continental America Super Lightweight Champion, Darrell Fastfist Fuller. Yes, sir. You've seen part of it. McKnight must be in some kind of condition to go down twice like that from those big punches and recover like he has. Jackson's in the right hand. Hand. Good combination by McKnight. Jackson comes back with a right hook. A left hook. They change punches here in the round. Oh, Keith McKnight pulling out all the stops here. In there exchanging punches with Phil Jackson, getting some and giving some. the winner by unanimous decision, Keith McKnight.